Hi guys, I'm back again with a new video today and this video is about installing IntelliJ as your integrated development environment on the Apple Silicon M1 chip. So as always, I'm going to download the installation file, run the installation process and then I'm going to start or try to start the actual application and run a very minimal demo app. So at first, IntelliJ. Uh, go to download from ChatBrains. I think the community edition should be fine for our Alright, so I will see you when the download is finished. Alright, the download is finished, so I am gonna unpack the downloaded file and try to install it. Yes, I'm going to drag it. Alright, so this takes up a couple of seconds. That was pretty fast. And now I'm starting IntelliJ. Yes, I want to open it. So it's jumping like all the other applications in the past. It's not closing immediately like Eclipse yesterday. All right, so that's looking good so far. Yes. Uh, start using. All right, I'm using or I'm starting to use, so IntelliJ is doing its things and starting up. I mean, if you're a Java developer, I would highly suggest using IntelliJ instead of Eclipse right now, because IntelliJ is working and Eclipse is not even starting. All right, uh, additional libraries, no. Do you want to create a project without no SDK assigned? Yeah, sure. Download JDK. Yeah, yeah. The JDK download did not uh, start yesterday with Eclipse because Eclipse wasn't even starting. So I guess that was the issue yesterday. So download is nearly finished. Now it's finished. Okay. Don't want to use additional libraries. Command line app, that's totally fine. Uh, demo app, why not? Okay, now IntelliJ is firing up. Can remove this notification. And so far, so good. Uh, tip of the day, I don't care about your tip. Um, I guess Java system. Is there some kind of IntelliSense or not? Okay, it's still indexing. So let's just wait till the indexing is finished to show you the complete time it takes. Some kind of experimental feature alert, you must accept the terms to a neighbor. I think that's related to Java. Okay. System, now you do see IntelliSense, print line. I am running on Apple Silicon. Okay, now let's start this console application and we should see the output in the console that the program is running on Apple Silicon. Here we see the proof actually, Java is running on Apple Silicon and so is IntelliJ. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will catch you in the next one. Bye.